What's up everybody, it's Jelly with Squid Industries and today I'm gonna be teaching you all how to do the whip rollover. The only prerequisite trick I recommend you learn before learning the whip rollover is the thumb rollover. So if you don't know that, then watch our tutorial for it. And if you already do know that trick, then let's get to the breakdown. The whip rollover is just an index roll and then the whip around into a thumb rollover and a close like that. To do an index roll, all you're gonna do is just like how you learned the thumb rollover, is you're going to stick whatever finger you're doing the roll out on which in this case is your index finger, you're gonna stick that out. So you're gonna flick the bite handle out like this. Your, your wrist is gonna be turned this way. You're gonna flick out that bite handle and you're going to let go and stick out your index finger since you're rolling over that. And then your other fingers here are gonna curl in, making space for the belly to rotate. And from this point, you're gonna catch this bite handle here between your thumb and your index finger. So again, I'm gonna do that roll and then catch the bite handle just like that. So really simple. Once you got that bite handle in your hand, you're going to do this whip motion around straight into that thumb rollover. And if it's too difficult to do that at first, you can just stop it like this, whip it around, and then do the thumb rollover. So that's how you can break it down if you're having trouble with it. So once you're in this position, it's really similar to the ice pick opening and closing that I showed you in the basic openings video. You're just going to turn it around and then get straight into a thumb rollover. So it's a very similar motion to this. So if you haven't learned that, then go learn that trick. Once you have it here, you're just going to be pinching it almost like a pencil. It's gonna be with your index finger on top here, your thumb here, and then your middle finger just supporting it. And you're going to whip it around like that. So it's going to come up and you're going to bring that up with your wrist and come up and then twist it so that it turns this way. And the cool part about this trick is whipping it straight into that thumb rollover and that's what makes it look super smooth. So just work on that transition and then get it straight into that thumb roll and then catch it like that and that is the whip rollover. Now that you got the basic whip rollover down, you can throw it in some combos. Remember that you don't have to start every trick with just one handle with the safe handle or the bite handle. Depending on what combo you're trying to do, then you might have to start on the other handle. So just keep that in mind and I'll show you a couple different combos that use this whip rollover. All right, everybody, that's it for today's tutorial. Hope you all learned that whip rollover. If you're ready to learn some new tricks, then subscribe and hit that notification button so you get notified when we release more tutorials like this one. Also, comment down below what other tricks you're trying to learn so we can make tutorials for those. If you haven't already, then visit the Squid Industries website so you can pick up a Balasong trainer and start flipping and visit us on our other social media platforms as well. I'm gonna leave you all with a quick flipping clip, so see you next time.